What's up everybody, it is I, the Personified Sin Roy. And before I start this video, this is going to be a re-upload of my uh, reasoning for why Jericho is my waifu of all time on Grand Cross. So please note that this is before Super Awakening was announced. This is all also before, you know, the Archangels have been released. And of course, this is uh, one of my earlier videos, so... Please note that, you know, the way I sound and present myself is a little bit different to what you're used to. But yeah, I, re I really wanted to upload this again just to, you know, show why Jericho is my waifu and why I build her up. And preparing for Red Jericho, which is coming out tomorrow or today, of course, depending on your time code. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe for more. And of course, let's begin. What's up, everybody? personified sin of Grand Cross here, Roy, and today I'm doing a very different video than my usual ones. I would mostly do PvP and uh, the Knighthood boss battles or banner, but I've been really wanting to do this and I want to discuss and gush over my favorite unit in this game, my waifu, Shanko. And just to show how much I invested and really like using this unit. Just to show you at the base stats. Pretty high. So her with no equipment on, just to show you real quick, no equipment on on any of them. start off from here so we have the I think it's the blue one so the blue Jericho with no equipment on and I made you our gear for them her attack right now is almost 6,000 so it's 5,932 defense is 3,542 which is pretty low and the HP is at 51,830 now, with her UR gear, which I do have for her, brings it up to 12,562, defense to 6,970, and then her HP mm, somewhat went up to 97,876. And just show you on her UR gear. For attack stats, I'm still working on it, but I was able to get two of them to 3%. And then these, I just need to uh, probably use the, the hammer for it just to get these up to 3%. And there's the other one. And this one, I was able to get a full three. But this, has, I want to work on, but I think I want to save up gems just to do this. For defense, I still need to work on to be higher. As well here, need to work on these two. Her HP, pretty high, still need to work on and her other one as well. I'm pretty close to doing 3-3 and then having this one complete. Now let's go to the red Jericho. So her attack is pretty higher than the blue one. It's 6,172, defense is 3,000. 350 and the HP is 51,830 which is pretty minor now putting the gear on increases it up to 12,921 her defense to 6,690 and then her HP to 97,876 so it goes pretty high for these and then I'm gonna skip the green Jericho because she's actually one of the one of my better uh, Chonkos of using. We're gonna go to the to the other blue Chonko, new legend, and so her attack's pretty higher than the other two. So her attack six thousand three hundred eighty, defense to three thousand six hundred five, and then HP to fifty five thousand seven hundred ninety. And then with her UR gear, brings her up to. 13,232 and then her defense to 7,062 and her HP high 
higher than the other two Jerichos, the red and blue one, to 102,945, which, which are pretty high. And then, you know, with the Gila will actually bring, bring all this up. So let's go to my favorite version of Jericho, the green one. So her attack is 6,380. I think similar to the the blue guardian, the blue, uh, sorry, not guardian, the blue uh, legend Jericho. And then her defense 3,575 and then HP is 55,790. Now with the Tagir on, stats go very high. So 13,232. Defense 7,019 and then her HP to 102,945. So these are pretty high stats on the green one, which very heavily. And I just kind of want to show when I have her on the team with Gila, which I actually got UR gear for Gila. Let me double check if I have it on her. So I have her paired up with the green Gila. And I also did put your gear, but I'm not gonna discuss her as much. So when they're combined, and I have her uh, <clears throat> with the combination, the attack for Green Jericho is fifteen thousand three hundred and sixty. The defense seven thousand eight hundred and forty-six, and her HP one hundred twenty-two thousand six hundred and ninety. Now, if I fix that. The HP rollout and the defense, it's gonna wind up being higher than Escanor. And Escanor, I have him you are here as well. But after that, let's go back to my best girl and kind of show you how I have like you know all their stats pretty high. And I actually invested quite a bit. Just to quickly show you for all of them. Except for uh, the blue new legend, I'm missing one to 6-6 six, six her. But of course the other ones have them all 6-6. Six, six. And let me show you her outfits. So, for her outfits, I maxed out all of them. Oh, there's I'll fix that real quick. Okay, as I was saying, I maxed out. <laughs> Maxed out all of them, and so the weapons also maxed out. You know, I really, I really invested in her because I like using her more. And then I'm still working on uh, working on this one to finish off her cosmetic upgrades. But just to kind of show you like why I gush over her so much is just her outfit choice. Out of all the characters, her, I feel. These are better, like, like just, just marvel at this, like, it's amazing. Nurse outfit from the Halloween, it's great. Her SR one, SSR, it's great, nice. This one, most likely my least favorite from the new legend, Jericho, although it does emphasize her thighs. We got this one, very nice. We got the S, I believe it's the SR, SR outfit, or SR outfit. Nice. This one surprises I do like it because, uh, you know, within those armors, very heavy thighs. Then we got her maid outfit. I wouldn't mind her working for me. And we got this. And then of course the best best ones. Kumsu. Nice. This. And of course the hidden powers. Super nice. Of course here as well. This one, which I really like when uh, when you go over here with the short hair, it's amazing. But of course, with her best outfit, oh, go back to it. 
to show you her best outfit is this one because I mean I I just like you know it's a very sexy look you know showing off just one thigh but conserving another one and then of course with this short hair is just mm, exemplifies you know just how amazing of a unit she is and how underrated she is within the Grand Cross and then of course you know ignoring that she's barely 18 I believe she's higher than that now you know. but yeah just just amazing and then obviously her emotions her motion motion confirming that she's the best Re refusing the haters that say she's not she sat out on user quite often but I still do I don't use her in the 4v4 of course she's angry but it gives off uh, let's just say a very nice shot action and her worried that you will disagree but yeah but just to also show you one of the last things is that I've been getting pretty lucky on the banners when pulling and here it's just uh it's just a for her and I'm going to six six her or not six six sorry uh, to fully awaken her when it's available on global as I got four copies of the green Jericho and I'm gonna invest I think a majority of, of my time and, and like and items just to build her up because I really like Jericho like originally for me in the anime it was a Diane you know because why wouldn't anyone like a giant you know big uh, breasted uh, giant but then when I played this game and then I started using the green version. I really like Chonko that much. Like, you know, with her, with this card right here, her weak point, doing extra crits as long as they're, they're debuffed. Like, it's just, it just blew my mind. And then obviously with her ult, you know, the spike damage, when she always, I believe, crits you, crit. I mean, crit chance is pretty low, but she's always crits with her ult majority of the time. And then, of course, you know, with the Kila, does extra damage. But yeah, but that, honestly, that, that's all I wanted to talk about. Like, you know, yeah, Jonko is my best and favorite unit in this game. And my waifu. And... Yeah, I just really wanted to rush this over for some time. But I'm, I'm hoping you guys can relate and enjoy this showcase of Jericho. Well, until next time, Roy is out.